I'm sure a lot of you must have heard about Tata Sky Plus, the new DTH service by Tata Sky, which ensures happy married life, brilliant breakfast on your bed services, and also some rather weird dance moves to the tunes of Jinga Lala. Ankit, those are the fringe benefits. <laughs> okay, girl, so why don't you enlighten me about the oh-so-obvious benefits? Well, actually, this is a, uh, a facility which which gives you uh, complete control over your television viewing. Mm -hmm. it, um, it, it allows you to pause, rewind and record live TV, which basically means you can watch TV when you want, not when the broadcasters want. Okay. I'm sure they wouldn't be too happy about that part. Okay. But um, it's completely changed the way I watch TV. How exactly does this one, uh, one small little black box help you rewind, um, pause and well, record this TV? This just isn't any ordinary small box. Mm -hmm. It's got uh, approximately 48 hours of uh, programming, recording potential. Okay. So you have those many numbers of hours you can record. Okay. And uh, the best part is that uh, more often than not, a lot of us want to watch shows which we physically can't because of work commitments or some of us have social commitments okay. and you just press record and it, it all comes back. For instance, I personally uh, use it to record a lot of TV. Okay. I, for me, record is my most popular function. And you Everything can program your box to record any particular well, you show? you actually go to your guide. Okay. You go to your guide and you scroll, 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 ah, record. Scroll, 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 record. That's what you really do. You scroll down and whatever you like, it's very simple. You just press the R button okay. and it records it. So, Gul, uh, tell me this. How many channels or how many shows can you record simultaneously? Let's say between 8 and 9, there are two favorite shows coming. Can you record both of them? Two. Yeah? Yes. In fact, what you could do is you could actually go on competing channels and record both their prime time programming. Okay, so record is clearly the function that you use the yes, most. Yes, it's my, it's my favorite function. All the pause I find is also extremely helpful. And because how? I mean, the thing is, you know, so many things happen, although I diligently try and not take any phone calls after 7 because that's like my zen time. Okay. But they will be suddenly, oh my god, my director's calling. So I, I'll, I'll pause it and take the call or sometimes, you know, you just want to take a call. You're expecting a call, you need to take that call. You spoke about pausing. Now, for example, let's say there's a live cricket match going on and I pause the live feed, okay? Now, once I resume it, uh, I'm obviously going to be, let's say, 10 minutes behind yes. the live uh, yes. transmission. I don't want to be a dodo where my neighbor's already celebrating well, India's uh, victory and I'm like... If you if you're really finicky and you want to see every single ball bowled, you can you can remain 10 minutes behind live and continue to watch it. Now can I jump back and to you live? And you can just press TV and go back to live. Okay, but how many minutes can you actually rewind back to? From the time you first came to that channel. All right. I mean, uh, in continuity. Okay. So the moment if you if you've been watching this particular channel for 10 minutes, mm -hmm. you can uh, you can rewind till the back last time you came here because that's how much the hard disk is backing up okay. as you're going. Well, thank you so much for enlightening all of us with the key features of Tata Sky Plus. Now, okay. while I make some good use of that knowledge, why don't we make some good use of your legendary tea-making skills? Ah, well, you know, Ankit, I don't really like you, but <laughs> since I'm a good host, I shall organize some wonderful tea for you. All right. In the meanwhile, you go check out what our tech experts have to say about the revolutionary DTH service, which lets you pause, rewind, and record live television. Okay, so what we're talking about here is probably the first PVR in the Indian market that you've heard of. It's not really the first PVR. The first PVR was actually launched by DISH. It's called the DISH PVR. It's been available for almost a year and a half in the market. And sadly, it's never been promoted. But this is the one that's been promoted. So hence, it looks like the first PVR in the Indian, Indian market. But it's also the most usable PVR in the Indian market as of now. It's 160 GB capacity, which is about 45 hours of total recording time. You know what that means? That means ad-free, you can actually record the entire set of friends all the way from the first season to the seventh season completely on a single pvr now that's a lot and lot of episodes now recording all of that stuff is so simple all you need to do is go to the episode and press the series link button it'll just go through the entire set of schedules and record that program again and again and again and again every single time a new episode comes up it'll not record repeats only the fresh episodes. So that's the cool part about the box. Let's look at the back of the box and see the kind of connectors that are on offer. And there's quite a lot of surprises there. So you'll actually see that you've got two TV tuners in here because it allows you to do two simultaneous recordings or record one and watch one. You've got a fairly extensive set of video connectors. It allows you the high quality component video out for your LCD TVs or HD TVs and a normal set of connectors for your existing TVs. And even the old vintage TVs that could accept only one connector, hey, you can even use this box on those. 
and you've got digital audio out. So you can actually use an optical out or a coaxial out and connect this to your home theater system and actually enjoy digital audio quality across the board. Now you've also got an ethernet port and a modem port and a USB port. These ports would allow this box to do so much more. You could play videos from the USB stick, you could play videos from your PC using the ethernet or you could use the interactive features of this box which is two-way interactivity buy stuff and do all sorts of other things using the modem but sadly all three of these ports have been disabled this box cannot make use of any of this functionality now that's a huge opportunity lost at 8999 this is a good pvr but it could have been so much more all it takes is a software update now we don't know when that software update is coming but as far as we know it's not there. 